Hello everybody, welcome to tutorial 6 and now that we have visualized our um, data and direct sun, sun hours to be particular through the plugin Ladybug in Grasshopper using this script over here um, we can now go ahead and prepare that to be diagrammed into Illustrator and a way to do that is to use the make2d command in um, Rhino so basically the make2d um, command in Rhino allow, um, makes a 2d image of the 3d view into line work and that can be exported as line work to any software and um, being that we're using Illustrator in this um, uh, particular um, um, method we're going to be using the make2d command for today so what we need to do now is um, create a view so a new layout, I'm just going to call this diagram, I'm using the A3 dimensions, uh, A3 paper, and go ahead and create that, make this full screen. Um, we can now change that view, I'm going to go and set view isometric, and we use the southwest, we can zoom select to that area, make sure that it's within the boundaries we want. I'm going to go ahead and lock this um, view so now it doesn't move um, and create a new layer and call that sun path01 and I'm going to go ahead and bake the sun path into that layer yep and now as you can see the screen went black and that's because we've got all this text around um, which is being scaled into that view that's why it looks a bit weird so we can go ahead and select text get rid of that go back to our diagram we can turn off um, these components here hang on a sec there we go I don't need this point either so we delete that um, and we don't need this point either. And hide that. And that looks about right. Um, so now we can go ahead and select all of this. Then click, uh, right, type in the make 2D command. So the necessary um, settings we need is a viewport, viewport rectangle, which is critical for Illustrator, and maintain source layers because. Um, yeah, that ca contains the, source, the layers from here and imports that into a new layer for the Make 2D. Then we hit click OK, wait for that to load. And we'll tap. Now, as you can see, there's been a, a problem and it hasn't um, made everything into line work. Now, that's because of the tolerance, so we can go up to options, go to units and the absolute tolerance is 0 0.001 we're just going to go make that one unit you can go back and do the make 2d command and that should work now go back to top view And as you can see, that make to d has worked and has all the necessary layers that we need. Um, tune in for the next episode where we visualize this through Illustrator. Thank you for watching.